people only see the benefits of fame well there's a lot of great things that comes with fame like everything is for free going in the clubs or that and that and that whatever but there's also the things that come uh, the costs that come and uh, one of the things i hate about fame is people impersonating you to fool other people uh and what pisses me too are the people who are so easy to fool uh, so you know every every month every two three weeks uh there's somebody uh, taking all my photos on my public uh facebook and uh making a fake profile and most of the time they talk to people sometimes they ask for money sometimes they they talk to girls and they they, they try to catfish them okay well why not uh, the last one uh, so this week there's a instagram profile uh, they also have a Facebook profile, so probably it's part of, it's, it must be the same person who's trying to fool a lot of people with this. They have a, uh, a lot of French artists, uh, fake Instagrams, fake Facebook profiles, and they offer iPhone 7s. And they pretend that you have to send a private message and that you fill some form and probably put your credit card or whatever and this is how they start stealing your money or whatever and that's fucked up so uh, of course uh, i've been reporting i've been reporting them uh, and then i receive a message from from somebody who, who comes to my real instagram and tells me yeah this is not cool what you did yeah stealing money from the people i'm like what you mean you, you went to the fake account you got your money stolen and now you come to the real one I know it's the internet I know not everybody is web savvy I understand but come on a little bit of that people want free stuff so much that they forget to be careful it's the internet you have to be fucking careful you have to be more careful than in real life in real life, if somebody offers you something for free and then you have to go like in a little cave and then you get robbed or raped or killed, it's the same thing on the internet. The internet, like every, every time somebody offers you something for free, you have to be super careful. You have to, you have to look, make sure the account is legit, if it's verified or not. Uh, give you an example, my Instagram profile has 70,000 followers the fake one has 300 followers so of course the fake one and um, so when it comes to to reporting uh, fake Facebook accounts they are really usually very reactive like 24 hours 48 hours max and they remove the account but when it comes to the Instagram ones, this account has been, I've been, I reported it uh, like four days ago and I'm still waiting for them to say something and uh, it's getting annoying, really. Maybe the difference is that my, my Facebook page is verified and my Instagram account is not, even if everything is tied to the same thing, but yeah. Uh, it pains me to see that some people are getting, are falling in this trap and that my name is associated with it but what can i do uh, i cannot stop motherfuckers to be money hungry and be ready to scam people but hopefully this will be resolved soon and uh, really i hope people will get smarter when it comes to giving their information online and uh... in a lighter note um i put a I put a photo on my Instagram uh, asking people uh, what country they were representing or where they were from and to reply with the flag so everybody reply with uh, different countries and the ones that really made me happy were the ones who just put the earth because that's exactly my philosophy I really represent planet earth I don't even if like 
I put the, the, the free countries I represent. Uh, I'm actually going to edit my post and add the world. But the world is a, is a global community of different people who win more by exchanging and uh, blending, making their all, making their culture richer by exchanging, mixing, than uh, everybody staying in their own corner and looking at the other like this. And uh, I know it's a dream because the human nature is to be belligerent and uh, to always try to kill one another for the resources, for the size of your house, for your iPhone or your, your Samsung or your Android or your iOS, whatever. Or people love to bitch about anything and fight and be fanboys and to the to the max. But um, I really believe in unity because the unity is the only way to be strong. But yeah, that's my belief. Yep, I just left my buddy Ligio to the train station. We just went to Malaga, Spain to a Kizomba festival. I have too much work, I have to finish my album. So I'm going home. Well, actually, I'm gonna watch Luke Cage first. And then maybe I'll do some work on this damn album that I have to finish. 